right, let's try out this Fremont Fish Market Wild Caught Crunchy Fish Filet made with whole fillets ready in minutes. All right, we're going to put this inside the air fryer and it's going to be for, let's see, I think it's uh, 12 minutes at 425 for 10 to 12 minutes. All right. All right, I already have the fish fillets in the air fryer basket. Put it in. Guess we gotta plug it in first. Now it says four minutes. Well, four twenty-five. Huh. Well, the air fryer don't go up to. 425, so we're going to put it on 400 for, yeah, let's do 50 minutes and see what comes out. All right, you guys, we got seven minutes left. Let's check and see what we got. Okay. Can you hear it sizzling? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to just go ahead and flip them over. They feel like they're pretty much kind of done, but I think I can also finish them up and, yeah. So let's let it go ahead for the continuation of the seven minutes, or I'll check it three minutes before it's done. All right, you guys, I got three minutes to spare of the 15 minutes I initially set the timer at but I'm gonna take it out now because I think it's uh, pretty much done let's see look at that they're golden brown okay you can hear they're not soft they're perfectly crisp Oh yeah. So if you're gonna be eating these little uh, fish fillets, uh, 400 at 12 minutes is actually really perfect. All right, guys. As you can see, I already made up my sandwiches with lettuce, tomato, onions, and pickles, and some tartar sauce on my toasted whole wheat buns. So now I'm going to just add my fish. I mean, these are really perfect. So don't forget, 412 minutes. And you just, half the way, you flip them over so they can get nice and toasty on the other side. And there you have it. Check that out, guys. Now, that's a good sandwich. That's a good one. Okay, look at that. All right, guys. So, try it out. This air fryer is something else. I'm going to leave a link in the description so you can see where I got this air fryer. All right, guys. Bye.